Hello, everybody, and welcome back. We are here playing more Ghost Watchers, which is going to be pretty fun. The uh, They pushed out an update as of the last video where um, they apparently didn't like that uh, people could do the pentagram ritual, um, which, you know, locked the ghost in place and then went ahead and did the ectoplasm collection because it was super easy, right? It's super easy mode because the ghost can attack you. And I guess that wasn't exactly how the developer intended it for it to function. Um, so they, as of the last uh, update, they made it so that you have to do the ectoplasm collection before the ritual will unlock and allow you to do it. So uh, today we're just going to be exploring some of the maps that we hadn't explored uh, yet, yet previously, but we're also going to be doing uh, the ectoplasm collection and the pentagram ritual uh, modifiers um, in the order that they're intended to now be. So we're going to see, you know, how different that is, if it's more challenging, um, and if it's more fun. So, uh, you know, that all said, let's go ahead and just dive right on in to the games. Here we are. We're at the, uh, the lodge. Let's go ahead and just pick up some of our, our gear. So, first thing I'm going to want to do is go ahead and get these in here so that uh, we can see if it interacts with any of them. Go ahead and grab some of our other equipment so we can start uh, narrowing stuff down. Spirit, can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Can you talk? It looks like we already found the skull, which is great. Go ahead and toss this here for now. Oh, we got... That's a particle activity. It is right here. Spirit, can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? All right, we have 500 to 1,000. like we got it was up in 50 so we know that it's a high temperature ghost which i think narrows down a lot of the uh, original ghosts right okay so it's going to be the vampire demon or the puppet i don't think it could be the babadook yet i don't think i'm level 20 um but yeah let's just double check the temp yeah there we go 50 Actually, we don't even need that to be in here anymore. Let's go ahead and toss it out here. And let's go ahead and grab the uh, the EMF reader. Yeah, this map is absolutely uh, amazing. It's very beautiful. And I didn't get a chance to see picture moved. Um, I didn't get a chance to see what our side objectives were, so. Five? Yep, MF5. Alright. Spirit, can you talk? Can you speak? Can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Nothing yet. Alright. Uh, that. Go ahead and put EMF5. Oh, it's a vampire. Right off the bat. Okay. So we don't know what its temperament is. Can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Okay, bloodstains. Can you talk? K9. 
Can you talk? Can you talk? All right, so that means that it just tried to drag me, but it wasn't able to because I have my super OP bracer that I purchased from the store. Oh my god. All right. Can you talk? All right, we got crying. So it's a more it's a slightly more passive ghost at least at this time. Which is good to know. All right, let's go ahead and toss this. All right. Uh crying. Yep. Can you write in this book? Tell us about yourself. Talk about yourself. Take this doll. Spirit, tell us about yourself. Write in this book. Yeah, so one thing I've noticed that with the more passive ghosts, the, the non-growling ones, is that it takes a really long time sometimes for them to interact with all of the uh, passive items on the ground. Um, so almost to an annoying degree, uh, but it's fine. So, all right, so these are our side objectives. Capture the ghost in the video, bring the cursed mirror to the car, bring the cursed toy to the car. So I already saw the cursed toy. Um, so we can go ahead and use this. We know it's a vampire, and that means that our defensive items are these, uh, the cross as well. The cross will start pissing it off. That's what it and irritates it means. So it's going to start getting more aggressive, even if it's like one of the crying ghosts uh, as time goes on, if I keep using the cross. But it is the best defense item um, that we have. So go ahead and give it a shot. Oh, found the pocket watch. All right, toss that there. Okay, moves randomly on the Ouija board. It's ancient. All right, we just need to figure out the rest now. Is that? Oh, okay, so it lifted the voodoo doll. Or raised it. There we go, raised voodoo doll. Okay, so we can go ahead and uh, manifest the ghost now using our cool device here. All right, so our first step is the silver bomb. So that is a defensive item that we could use. So we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll go look for some of the other items that are um, in the house somewhere. So we do have to find three more items in order to do the exorcism ritual. There's something. That's a rose. Okay, so we got the rose. And we do have a, our drone um, that gives us that fourth slot. So that's why we're able to kind of pick everything up as we go instead of having to drop things, which is really super handy. All right, let's just double check these rooms over here. Make sure there's no more secret hidden items anywhere here. And the screen is just vibrating on this thing like crazy. Right, going in the basement, which is always a treat for everyone. Got the mask. Oh, here it comes. Anything in here? we can play with? No? All right. So the silver bomb, even though it's a weakening step, uh, won't make it more aggressive, I don't think, unless just inherently weakening the ghost does make it slightly more aggressive. So we just need one more item there. What's the next step? Light three candles at the location. Oh, that'll be fun. 
I think that holy fire is uh is a, a, a tool we can use to yeah okay so that does protect us without irritating it and it'll also light candles now oh, well we'll just step out for a second okay let's go find some candles see it'll it'll light the candles as you walk by them which is pretty handy and very good to know in case you uh, accidentally light candles uh, for one of the objectives. There we go. All right. We're also going to need this for um, for seeing the ectoplasm a little bit later. So we'll uh, we'll need to do that. What's the next one? Oh, never mind. We're going to have to use the holy fire, and we'll probably wind up buying another one then. All right. So let's see if we can go find the last ritual item. So we do have some side objectives to bring the cursed toy and the mirror to the car. I wish it would stop vibrating the screen. <laughs> it's going off like crazy. I hear you. Oh, there we go. What's this? We got the dream catcher. All right. Go ahead and throw this downstairs. Yeah, so let's go try to get the other side objectives, which I believe the toy is here. Yes. Right. Don't don't get me, ghost. Alright. We got this cute little toy. Toss it here. Nice. All we have to do is the first mirror is the other side objective. It's just immediate as soon as I walk in. really tossing the thing around. All right, let's go find this mirror. Seems very annoying to try and find right now. I actually don't think I saw it when I was looking around earlier. You in here? Do you have any of those cursed mirrors I can play with? Love to uh, take on that kind of risk. Maybe it was... It could be that it was downstairs. In the basement. Oh, hi there. Uh, no curse... We actually have to blow these candles out, so let's just do that now. Alright, we're gonna get attacked here, I think. There's the curse mirror. Got it. Try to get out of this house without it attacking us. Yeah. Alright. So we have the curse mirror. All of our side objectives are done. We're solid there. Excellent. Alright. Next step is blow out all the candles, which we can do, and then a plasma absorber. I do want to keep this plasma absorber for when we're trying to defend ourselves. To get ectoplasm. Uh, I do actually need the torch. Maybe we'll just toss this here for now. I, I hate that idea, actually. Uh, the camera doesn't help. We'll throw that down. 
Um, and we will buy another torch. Because we need to be able to see where these ectoplasm orbs are. Alright. Is it going to attack immediately when I walk in? No, not this time, it seems. Any ectoplasms? Oh, I gotta blow these candles out. Let's just step outside. We're close to the front door. Preserve our protection items. Stairs. We can go... Where? That last candle at. Hear it. There you go. There you go. Oh, it was right here. It's over there. Where is it? Any ectoplasm orbs here? No? Oh, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and toss that there, and we're gonna start doing this. Okay. That seems a little unfair. You know? Like, why did I just have to use two defensive items right there? Shouldn't the plasma absorber have banished it? Or was it because there was a hunt going on right when I was starting to channel the plasma? Ectoplasm, I mean. Uh, it, that, that seems a little wonky, but whatever. Here we go. We got our first uh, first drain down. Uh, let's see. What else can we use? We can use... Holy water. Yep. Do that. We got to go find it. Plasma Absorber is on cooldown, so we can't use that one again, although that is probably the best way to defend yourself. I think. Oh my god, please. Okay, we made it out. Okay. Let's check downstairs and see if there's any orbs down here. Here we go. Alright, we're gonna have to throw the holy water at it. I'm not sure why it didn't try to attack me there, but I'll, I'll take it. Alright, we'll go ahead and deposit our ghost goo. Here we go. Osmo Absorber is almost fully charged. We do have four items though, right? Yeah, can't pick it up. But we could... No. Nope. You know what? Let's set it to attack. We'll throw our holy water at it. No, you don't. Not today. All right. Oh, they used the plasma absorber outside. This game, I swear. All right. All right, holy water is done. Next thing, all we got to do is the pentagram ritual. So we just need to find that last uh, plasma. Looks like holy salt is something we can use to defend ourselves. And we might as well bring... No, we can't. Where was it that I first bombed this thing at? In the kitchen? No? Nope. Get out of here. Let's check over here. No. 
Ah, here it comes. Getting really angry at us because we keep uh, weakening it. Oh, there it is. Yes, I dodged it. All right, let's go upstairs. Any more plasma up here? Nope. Nope. Should have used a different item. <laughs> now I gotta go buy another holy torch. Alright. So we have to go find that last plasma. I. It might still be in the basement. Next time we throw the holy salt at it. Oh, come on. Yep, yep. Okay. Where is it? We need to find it. I hear it. There it is. All right. I'm gonna throw that there. Try to steal the ectoplasm. And it reset my progress, but it does seem to be going faster, maybe? Alright, we got it. No! And it, it absorbed that again. I really hate that. If it's outside, it shouldn't function. Anyway. Alright. So we have everything we need there, right? We got, our, we got our ball online now. We don't need that anymore. Um, last thing we need to do is the pentagram ritual, which shouldn't be too bad. And then we should win. No. Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Gotcha. All right, let's do this. Skull. What do we got next? Mask. Perfect. Catcher. Okay. Two more. Rose. No, 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 no. Stay away from me, purple circle. Then obviously it's going to be right here. I just want to take a quick look at this guy, because you can actually get pretty up close and personal with them once they're uh, they're captured, and they look pretty cool. Gotta say, right? Nice. All right, let's capture. Him. All right. So it's not too bad with the. Uh, the ectoplasm where you know, you have to do it before the ritual now, which means the ghost can attack you. But I have had issues with the ghost mood not being one of the more calm ones, where it's the uh, the more aggressive kind, like the aggressive and haunting. Um, those things can get really um, terrible <laughs> to play. So I think that some balancing probably needs to go into, you know, when the ghost can attack you and things like that. But I mean, it's doable. It's just frustrating, and you do have a, a pretty high chance of dying if you're not 
uh, fully prepared, but not so bad. Uh, we'll go ahead and move on to another map. All right, here we are. We're here at the church, which is a pretty awesome map. Um, in my opinion, it, it is very atmospheric, very cool. It is kind of big though, and I'm kind of worried about the ectoplasm collection process, um, but it's fine. Take a photo of ectoplasm. Correctly identify the ghost the first time, so don't screw up, don't guess. Uh, use the curse mirror. Take a picture of a ghost attack. All right, those are all super doable. So we'll go ahead and drop our initial items in here. This place is, oh, there's the cursed mirror, like right off the bat. I keep forgetting that I have four slots now. Whoa, where'd the notepad go? Did it? Hello? Uh, flip to the ground. There we go. Uh, we'll put it here, because I don't want to lose it. In case. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and use the curse mirror real quick. Don't need it anymore. We're out of here. Alright. Go ahead and turn this light on. Okay, never mind. I guess we won't be turning the light on. Alright, let's go grab some of our other stuff. Can you speak? Can you talk? Can you talk? Spirit, can you talk? Can you talk? We'll go ahead and toss that here for now. See if we can wander around and find anything. Found the rose. The ritual is usually over here. From what I understand. Yep, there it is. Toss that there. Uh, lights, please. Okay. We have not found any trace of the ghost particles yet. Anything in here? No. This is a door up to the outside, and it actually goes into a graveyard, which is kind of spooky. Oh, we found the, the watch. Perfect. There is a basement to this place too, and it's it's in my opinion it's pretty creepy. I'm actually not a huge fan of going down there because it's just so dark and windy. But uh we'll do our best. Over here, nothing, nothing. Alrighty. So far, not any indication of of the ghost particles anywhere. Back in here. Nope. Do we have any anything on the pews at all? Okay, let's go ahead and uh, I guess we're gonna have to go in the basement pretty soon. That's probably where the ghost is. Just to really complicate things, you know? Anything in here? Got the skull. That's nice. I hear something. Can you talk? Oh, crying. At least it's a passive ghost. I didn't touch any of those yet. Alright, so... 
tried to drag us, but it's not giving us any... Oh, Dreamcatcher right here. Nice. We got four of the five items, like, without even having to use anything to help find them, which is pretty amazing. I'm guessing the last one's probably downstairs. We still don't know much about this ghost, though, other than it likes to cry. sounds. That place is long and windy. There is actually a secret room here too, um, which is pretty cool. And if this ghost attacks, I'm dead. There's the cursed toy. This room as well. Anything in here? I need the mask, I think, right? masks in here. Creepy hidden masks. Okay, this is the secret room that I was talking about. Doesn't look like there's any masks in the secret room. I think we need to kind of start heading out. I didn't see any masks down there, which is kind of surprising. Oh, there it is. Yes. Awesome. Cool. So we don't need to do a whole lot when it comes to the ritual. We can go ahead and start it. Oh, here we go. No? Here? Okay. Don't want it to start attacking me just yet. Has it done any of these things? No. Leave this here. We need to be kind of close to the door so we don't have a defensive item to save us. We do know that it's actually here now though, which is good. write in this book. Tell us about yourself. Take this doll. Maybe we need to move this slightly more this way. Particle reader. Oh. Okay, it moves back and forth on the Ouija board. Moves from side to side. skull are you here no it's just a random event i swear that these things don't actually mean the ghost is nearby which is kind of annoying a book skull This map seems to have like a more ominous like droning soundtrack to it, which is actually pretty cool. 
I like it. Better than some of the other games that have a similar effect, although this one it seems like it's more almost uh, cinematic in a way, or epic sounding. Like it does help build tension. This is like super duper shy. Oh, I hear it now. It means it's probably going to start attacking. That's concerning because I still don't know what it is. At this part of the game is a little frustrating because like I can't realistically push too far in until I know what it is and I know how to like kind of defend myself a little bit what's over here Run! Run! Didn't attack. Must have been too far away. This one still hasn't been finished? Come on. Where are you? Where are you? Can you take this doll? We can be a little bit more confident in this area just because there is a door right there that we can get out of. See? Upstairs, downstairs, where are you? Oh, it's right there. Super creepy. Okay, 500 to 1000. That should give us how old it is. Yeah, it's older. Negative 14.9. EMF 5, it seems. Alright. That is EMF 5. This one. So it's the Drowned. Or, oh no, it could be the Dream Devourer. I didn't see any footprints though. So I'm thinking Drowned. And then we just need the voodoo doll, which we can't, if we want the side objective, we can't guess, right? Can you take this doll? Take this doll. It hasn't touched the doll, and it did touch the other two items. I th I'm thinking it's probably going to be doesn't interact with the doll. Which is kind of a hard category to predict. I'm okay if uh, we get it wrong on the first guess. And we got it right. Cool. Alright, so we know we know it's the drowned. Uh, the Jesus statue will protect us. Holy salt is the first first thing to do. So what is our static defense? Uh, withering light. Okay. 
Right. Right, alright, so probably fire will also protect us. We'll take the fire as well. Try to find where are you? There it is. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Got it. All right. Go drop this off. That is one of the good things about these bigger types of maps is if the ghost isn't near you when you start collecting ectoplasm, it can take a really long time for it to come get you and you might be able to complete it before that's the case. Uh, not always, sometimes the ghost is pretty close to you at all times, so. Definitely don't want that, but... So the, the, the other uh, ectoplasm orb will not appear unless we, um, we weaken it for the first time, which we haven't done yet. So... We can look forward to that. I don't think it was close enough to actually initiate a hunt on us. Okay. Just have to check over here, make sure that we're not missing any orbs. But we have kind of looked everywhere so far. Oh god, it's over here. We're going this way. Right. Doesn't seem like the ectoplasm is here. So we will just look elsewhere. is here. Where is it? Can we... Nice. Alright. Oh, it's right there. Get away from me. EP. Alright. Let's go ahead and deposit this. And what else protects us from the drowned? Uh, looks like fire salt. Will. As well as regular salt. What's our next one? Oh, open all five water taps. I don't know if that sucks. Take a photo of ectoplasm. So we need to do that next. Take a photo of a ghost attack. Okay, so we're fine there. Um, let's also bring some... F no, we can't. Ah, the Jesus should protect us fairly well. We can always use the fire in a last ditch effort if we need to. Just checking for ectoplasm here. Looks like we're about to get attacked.
gotta find that ectoplasm. Oh god. Away from me. Did I already look here for ectoplasm? I might have. Definitely don't want to go back downstairs right now. It does seem like this ghost is very heavily up here. Go check the kitchen. We are going to eventually have to go back downstairs to shut off the water that the ghost keeps turning on down there. But uh, we don't need to do that just yet. Can you turn off, please? Oh my god. Here it comes. Run! 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 Okay. All right, we got the photo. We no longer need that. We might want to pick up some additional protective items. My Jesus statue is running real low on juice here, so um, let's get rid of this. Oh no, we need to take a photo of ectoplasm. Damn. You know, maybe we find it first. We'll come back for the photo. Uh, let's see. What else can we use? Fire salt. Let's bring that. We, uh, withering light's also pretty good, but we can bring that in a second. Oh, we gotta get the flask, actually. That would be better. Let's do that. Oh, where did it go? Oh, it's on the ground. Okay. Perfect. Nope. I don't want you to attack right away, please. I don't want to have to buy the ectoplasm finder. I'm going to be really pissed if I have to do that in order to get it. But, uh... Is it in here? Any ectoplasm? No. Just double check everything. Turn these off. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna go up here. We have already kind of looked in this area. I hear the ghost over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you can float stuff. You're really cool. I make sure you check everywhere because the range on detect detecting. Oh my god, what just happened? Why did it just. Okay. Guess I'm going to need another. Uh... My, my game glitched out and started to minimize, and then it made me throw my torch on the ground, which was pretty cool, I think. Not in here, right? We already we checked this. Definitely checked here. No? I hear water running somewhere. Right here? Yeah. You need to make sure these are off, because... oh god. 
these ones too. Now here it comes. Is it gonna reach me? Yep. Oh, thank you. Alright. It, it has locked me inside a being attacked position. Alright, cool. Free now. No, it's not over there. No, it's not here. This is frustrating. Where's the ectoplasm? You're supposed to also be able to hear it when you get close enough to it. I haven't heard it, but also this torch is like super duper loud, so. You know what? I am giving up. I'm gonna go get the ectoplasm detector, even though it costs like 200 money dollars in this game. We'll use our Jesus as our last fence here. Here's the ecto. Oh, 250. It's even more expensive than I thought. outside, right? It can't be in the graveyard. It might be downstairs. Okay. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay. Don't need that anymore. I swear I walked all over this place and yet still wasn't able to find that stupid thing. Alright, I we need to go we're gonna go get the withering light. I th think yeah, I have the Jesus, so that's fine. Ah, oh, I do need the camera too. Camera? Yes, I do have enough slots. Okay. We're gonna take a picture of it because that will give us some extra money to help cover the loss of money trying to buy a, a ectoplasm detector, which was pretty cool. Okay. All right, we're going to toss this here. And we're going to position ourselves here. Please do not attack me. Please do not attack me. Got it. got it we we did it it cost us more money than i would have liked but we still got it so all right pause it all right let's go catch this stupid ghost Okay. 
Bam. Oh no, I screwed up. Oh man, I'm just wasting money on this mission. Okay, so I was not at the ritual phase part of the weakening of the ghost, so that's my bad. Did we get all taps? No. Did not. You know what? I'm going to buy another Jesus statue. Definitely going to have to buy another ritual dagger when the time comes. But let's buy another Jesus statue. So expensive. All right. I'm going to put this here. Grab that. We don't need this right now. Uh, what we do need is to close all the taps at the location. So let's also bring another defensive item. This fire salt should work, right? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Let's go make sure that this ghost did not turn on a bunch of taps all over the place. All these taps are closed. This one's open. Awesome. So now we, we just need it to attack us. We need it to attack us with our Jesus Christ statue out. Probably go grab all the other things. We do need to buy the, the ritual dagger, because after Christ, it's kind of grand ritual. Okay. So, this. This. There we go. there and we got it all right let's take a look at this beauty right here so wonderful look how pretty she is hi there We did it. Cost us more money than I would have liked, but we still went positive after that experience. Uh, significantly so. Um, so yeah, that's great. Worked out. But uh, yeah, so you could kind of see how the ectoplasm ritual can be kind of uh, a struggle. Uh, we really didn't get any of the more aggressive ghost types during this video, but uh, yeah, I think that uh, it kind of showcases the different dynamic as to the last video that we did where you could do the pentagram which will lock the ghost in place and then not have to worry about it when you collect the ectoplasm it's certainly a real more a more relaxed uh, experience uh in the other reverse order but i think that this is probably ultimately more fun if it's not just if you can get past just how kind of annoying it can be occasionally um yeah all right cool all right, that's going to be it for the video today, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. It was a lot of fun experiencing it, uh, you know, with this this new, uh, I guess, complexity uh, with the, the modifiers having to be done in a specific order. 
Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you for staying tuned, uh, and I will catch you guys in the next video. See you later.